Leticia here. Well, this video started off to be a video about the yarn bag that my daughter Finesse got me for our anniversary. It ended up being a wedding slash anniversary video, so it has nothing to do with crocheting really. So you don't have to watch it, but those of you who choose to, enjoy! In this picture, this was the first time that Adam visited us at our home. Finesse was our chaperone on every single date. We did everything by the book and waited till we got married. Three months later, he gave me a promise ring. And four months after that, he asked me to marry him. So we met on January 17, 2004 and got married January 17, 2005. My son Daniel walked his little sister Finesse down and then they both waited for me at the foot of the steps. Here I come. When I got to the middle landing of the stairs, I got emotional when I saw Adam and I started to cry because I was so excited to marry him and make him my husband, as well as to give my kids the best dad that they've ever known. Once I got to the foot of the steps, Daniel and Finesse were waiting for me, and they both walked me down the aisle, and they gave their mom away to a man that they knew both loved me and them very much. They both knew that he would take care of all of us, and they each gave me away. In this next picture, Adam took the promise ring off of my finger and turned to Finesse and said, Finesse, I gave this promise ring to your mother with the promise to marry her. I'm doing that today, and now I give this to you, and I promise to be the best dad that I can be to you. And then he turned to Daniel and took off the promise ring that I had given him and said, Daniel, I give this to you today, and I promise to be the best dad that I can be to you. Oh my goodness, as soon as they announced Mr. and Mrs. Adam Wilson, Adam picked me up and pretended he was going upstairs to the bedroom and told everyone, Hey, I've been waiting a whole year. Of course we didn't go upstairs. He put me down and everyone started laughing. Our first dance was I Swear by John Michael Montgomery. Yay, Adam survived. We're headed to our honeymoon suite. I told him the weight wouldn't kill him. <laughs> okay, now on to what the video was really supposed to be about. Hi, Glamo here again with Made with Love by Glamo, where everything here is always made and taught by me with love. Um, today, I just wanted to show you something. It was my uh, mine and my husband's ninth anniversary on, um, set, was it Saturday? It was, the it was the 17th of January. I'm not sure if that fell on a Saturday. I think it was a Saturday. Um, and uh, my daughter was so awesome. <laughs> she treated us to a, a Red Lobster dinner and she um, treated us to a movie and um, a bunch, a bunch of gifts. One of the gifts that she gave me was a Joann's gift card. Woohoo! You should have seen my face. I have a picture of my face like, <laughs> making a really weird face.
Wow, look at that face. You would think I won the lottery, huh? Well, to me I did. I got a Joanne's gift card. Anyway, after, uh, after we went to a movie and then to dinner, I brought my gift card with me. So afterwards, we went and uh, shopped at Joanne's and she knew that this is what I had been wanting. But she wanted to make sure that I got the color I wanted and everything. But this is what I bought with the um, gift card that she gave me. This is what I've been wanting for a while. This cool bag. <laughs> So I'm actually using it for the first time today because I'm right in the middle of um, making the super, super easy hat tutorial, which I'm sure you'll recognize I'm wearing the same clothes as the tutorial. And this is the same yarn that I'm using for the hat tutorial. <laughs> but here it is. Isn't this just adorable? Isn't that cool? See? And it's got the top part, see? So that it's, let me see if I can hold it better. It's got the top part with the holes in it so that your yarn comes out through there so when you're working on your project and um, if you want to switch out your yarn you don't have to unzip it to get it out you can just um, pull it out through there it's big enough and you can either hold it like this or you can hold it from the handle right here see you can hold it like this and you can even let me see if I can do it fast enough so that I don't take up too much, too much video time. You can even, let me see. <laughs> Cause there's another way that you can hold it, kind of like a duffel bag. So I wanted to show you that as well. Um, but I'm having a harder time. I wasn't planning on actually showing you that. <laughs> so you can hold it like this too. See, you can hold it sideways like that or like I had it before, like that. But anyway, let me show you inside. It's so cool. Um, so this is what it looks like inside. It holds, um, like if you were to use Karen Simply Soft yarn, it holds like eight or nine of those. Um, this size, it holds about, right now I have one, two, three, four, five, but as you can see, there's still room in there for like another one. But isn't that cool? It holds a bunch of yarn. You can put stuff in here that you need. Um, and then it has this little bag to um, put your, uh, your hooks or your little crochet or knitting knickknacks in there. So I'm probably going to put crochet hooks in there. I don't have any in there right now. But I just wanted to show you this. I love it. It's awesome. It's cool. And it's got a nice little hard bottom and it's black so you can put it on the floor and it won't be dirty and it keeps its beauty. So anyway, I just wanted to show you that because I'm really excited about it. She went way above and beyond for our anniversary, I'm telling you. Um, she got me this, the gift card, and she got, ever since, my, my favorite movie is Gone with the Wind, and also all the Rockies, and also the Notebook, but mostly Gone with the Wind, and I read the whole 900 book, um, 900 page book of Gone with the Wind, and ever since I read the book two years ago, they're always talking about, well, Scarlett's always talking about how her mother smells like lemon verbena, um, how she has it in the folds of her skirt and how when she just walks by you can always smell lemon verbena. So ever since then I wanted to smell it and I wanted to have some so she bought me some of that. I wish you could smell it. When you first put it on it smells like those lemon head candies that I used to get as a kid but then when the perfume notes settle it smells so pretty. And she bought me a Rocky sweatshirt. <laughs> Maybe I'll post some pictures at the end of this video. Um, I used to be such a tomboy as a kid. I even went boxing with my brothers and changed my name to Lester instead of Leticia. And she got my husband, oh, and she bought me, um, she got my husband and I Red Lobster gift cards for $75, $75 Olive Garden gift card. She got my husband $150 worth of AMC movie gift cards because <laughs> he loves the movies. Um, got him like 14 different colognes, 
Um, and what else? And my husband got me what I've been wanting for years and years and years. He got me a diamond tennis bracelet. Look, look how pretty it is. <laughs> So anyway, hey, it doesn't go very good with my row counter, does it? I should take this off. But I'm in the middle of a tutorial. Thank you, babe. Thank you for my bracelet. I love it, love it, love it. I'll treasure it always. <laughs> oh, and he also got me some Coach perfume. Ooh, I love my Coach bags, but now I've got Coach perfume. Yay! Oh, and I got my husband one of those boxing things that um, it's it's the ball and it stands up on a on a pole that, with a spring and you hit it and it bounces back and you have to bob and weave you know to miss it so it's like a good workout. So I got him that. And I got him a really nice. Um, Number three, Wilson Seahawks jersey, official game day jersey. So it was a really nice one. Aw, and he looks so handsome in it. And so he just wore it yesterday, and yay, the Seahawks won! We beat the 49ers! <laughs> so now we're going to New York to Super Bowl 48! <laughs> yay! I hope we win! Anyway, that's kind of way off track, isn't it? I just mainly wanted to show you this bag and how sweet my daughter was for doing um, so much for our anniversary. And we always include her in our anniversary as well. So. I got, we got her four Ralph Lauren um, perfumes and a movie that she's been asking for. And, oh, she loves candles. So she's got a little Scentsy um, thingy, whatever you call it. So we bought her some candles for the Scentsy thing that she has. She loves candles. Mm, the house always smells like something good. <laughs> For our anniversary, we only got her these three gifts, but we've got lots of gifts to give her for her seventh baptism anniversary coming up in a couple weeks. I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, guys, I just wanted to share my joy in the bag that I've been wanting forever. It's going to travel with me to Texas. It's going to travel with me to doctor's appointments, wherever I go. All right, I better get back to... um the hat tutorial. <laughs> I'm sure you guys are going to watch this and uh, make the hat. So far, at this point, it's going to be just a big old long rectangle that I'm going to turn into a hat for you guys. All right, guys. Bye. Look at how pretty all our gifts look. I couldn't wait to open them. And here I am trying to do the Rocky Apollo Creed pose. <laughs> and there we are holding up all our gifts. And now look at how all the gifts look. What a mess, huh? And here I am holding the second book to the Divergent Trilogy set. Adam got me all three. There it is on my nightstand. And here's Adam using his AMC card. Can't wait for the movie Divergent to come out. Woohoo! There we are at Red Lobster, getting ready to eat our shrimp and lobster dinner. Ooh, chocolate covered strawberries. Thank you, Finesse and Adam. You made this anniversary so wonderful. I love you, babe. Happy anniversary!